Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you a really cool cut called the Sybil Cut. Now, this is actually a variation of the Sybil Cut by Chris Kenner, and this is my variation. Okay, so it's really cool. And I'm going to start off by teaching you the most bare bones version, the original version, which looks like this. Okay, so I'm going to head down to the blue mat in a second, so I'll be back. Okay, we're down at the blue mat. Now... So like I said, we're going to be teaching you the original version, which is a four packet cut, full deck false cut, so, oh that's the double backed card, here we'll just use that so I can prove it. And double back card's still there, let's get rid of that though. There. Now, you're going to start this off with a mechanics grip. And now, what you want to do is you want to come over with your right hand and get into this formation. This is called the Z. Normally, this is the Z, but sometimes it's an extra pack up here. So then you can do the cut. Um, so, yeah, so what you're going to do is you're going to Take your thumb and using your index finger as a pivot point, you're going to lift up about half the deck. So it's levered up in, in between your left index finger and your right thumb. Now what you got to do is take this, this, your right middle finger and lift up about three-fourths of this pack. Now, last, last, you take this, your right index finger and lift up half of this pack up here. So here it is. Now, this should not take too long. It only takes a second. And then once you're there, um, this, you'll notice that this bottom packet, you can swivel it around really far. So what you're going to do is you're going to swivel it up. Now using your right, your left middle finger and your left thumb, you grab this packet right there, this middle packet, and grab it at the, these edges. Now once you've grabbed onto it securely, you're going to release it with your right hand. Now with these two packets, you just move your right hand out and rotate your left hand down so you'll be in this position so so it's gonna look like this so then once you've gotten there this is the tricky part of the cut what you're gonna do is you're gonna use these three fingers you're gonna put your right middle finger here your in your ring finger on top and your pinky on the right so your middle finger is on the left this one on top and your pinky on the right so if you drop everything you're holding it like this and if you're doing this right you should be able to fold this inward because you're gonna have to in the cut during the cut fold it inward at one point so you want to grip it tightly and just curve your fingers in and that'll make it come in so let me so you're gonna go now once you're here you're going to what you're gonna do is sorry I dropped I almost dropped a card there now once you've grabbed onto it tightly you're going to 
release it with these finger two fingers and move your right hand upwards again and so you'll be in some sort of a triangle shape now what you need to do is repeat that first phase of the cut you're gonna swivel this packet up but instead of grabbing this packet you're gonna grab this packet with these two fingers rotate your right put your right hand outwards rotate your left hand downwards so now this is the you can if you want to you can hold this for just a split second so you, everyone can see the display now this is where we talk I talked about this is where what I was talking about folding it in you're gonna fold it inward curve your fingers in and come down leaving this pack out jogged all you're gonna do now is swivel it out flip it over put it on top so practice the basic version before you try to do the this my version of it that I'm about to teach you now oh. so in my version you're going you're not just gonna start like this you have to go like this this you're doing something that'll get you into that position it looks like this that was sloppy but you get the point so what you're gonna do is now you're gonna start with this in a biddle grip like like the grip you would use to do a swing cut but just hold it like that little grip so you're going to what you're gonna do is take this finger here oops sorry this finger here and pull down uh, maybe that was a little less but from about that much cards so you're gonna pull those down and you're gonna rotate this upward once you get to about here where it's about where there's a right angle here, you're going to take your thumb and put it there. And then once you have your thumb there, you're going to release your index finger and s keep swiveling it all the way till it's till it's symmetrical or horizontal, whatever the word is, with this packet. So that should all happen like that about that speed so once you're there you're gonna go like that now what you're going to rotate this packet that back and then once you're here you're going to swing cut half the cards and just drop this these into your hand so now what you're gonna do is here so first let me show you this slow before we move on. You ready? Okay. So, I'm going to swivel it around. X. Now what you're going to do is you're going to swivel this back and you're reversing what you did. You're putting your index finger here. Now you're just going to move over. Now you're going to rotate this back so you're like this in a Z formation. Now all you do is, you can probably guess now, just lift up half the cards here and you're in that position so that you can do the cut. Um, so, so let's do it slowly. So once you're there, you're going to go into the Sybil cut from here. You're, you're going to go like this, like this. Now once you're in this position, my dog's barking. Instead of grabbing this whole packet and moving it there, you're going to grab...
just half those cards. Now you're going to rotate your left hand upward like that and at the same time move your right hand downward. So here's your long display. Now you're going to come back, fold this packet in and come down but see this packet here? You hold on to that in between your index finger and your thumb but drop everything else sandwiching this card this pack. Now what you're going to do is hold, just set it in there, grip it like this. Now you're going to come over here and grab it, this packet here, and swivel it out so you got it like this. Well that's convenient. So all you're going to do is flip your hand over. You're going to flip this on top, rotate your hand back over, and just drop that on top. So yeah, so you're definitely going to have to practice that quite a lot. But it's so worth it. It's a really cool cut. And so here, let's follow along. Ready? Okay, so that's the Sybil Cut, and I hope you enjoyed that. That's it. See you next time.